I'm gonna start again. A junior in Mission San Jose High School. The match I'm about to show you is the last match of my junior wrestling career. Now, it's a pretty bad match. I mean, like, no form, no cardio, and no, you get the memo. Anyway, on. <laughs> Alright, for the shot. This shot was pretty solid, however, there were a couple mistakes I made. First of all, uh, it was a good check in the beginning, preventing him from being as ready for the shot as he could have been. However, I was not low enough and not quick enough to bypass his underhook. In the future, I could have simply uh, moved his arms while doing the shot or attempted doing a fireman scary so that his arms would not be an issue, instead would uh, be something I used to take the shot. That round was uh, pretty boring, pretty pathetic. Um, he took a couple shots, none of them were really good. Uh, I didn't think I took any other shots for the rest of that round, or I attempted it, but none of them were really, you couldn't really call them shots. For the second round, the ref threw the coin, he won it, so he decided to go bottom. Uh, we started off real quick with a pretty, pretty poor mat return. I attempted the heel block, completely, mostly failed. Um, he went into a head and arm, very unprofessional, very JV style, honestly really disappointed. All right, this was the silliest takedown I've ever got in my entire life. Um, we'll move on. All right, I'm gonna cut to this here tilt because I think it's a genuine educational moment. Uh, I'm gonna show a YouTube video describing uh, what you should do in that tilt, and I'll. So let's take a look. Boom! I got my two on one. I bring that knee in front. Boom! Into my lat. Knee up. Pull. Push. How's this feel right here? It hurts. Okay. Good. Okay, I'm gonna cut some more trash mat returns and more of my coach braiding. Stop doing that! Wait, is that is that how the other guy broke his ankle? From that? Okay, okay. He, he didn't actually watch that ball. I love it when I work someone for like 15 seconds and get no back points. But on a serious note, that was some really good defense on his part. I was completely incapable of getting him on his back for long enough to get my two points. personally disagree with the ref on this call, I don't think my opponent had enough control or the necessary hips on my hips to award him two points, however, the ref made the call and it is what it is. This was the second easiest two points I've ever received and they were both in the same match, god damn. Bro, I still managed to lose.
sorry. So real quick, post match analysis. I didn't want to interrupt the mewing experience of that horrible third round. Um, so basically, we were both like completely exhausted. Um, to get me over him, he kind of like pushed his hips up and uh, pulled me over, kind of. Um, yeah, it was really stupid. Uh, I don't know how I let him do that to me. I was way too tired. That's what I was talking about in the beginning about no cardio. Um, my weight was wrong too, so no form. And you know, uh, no, um, nothing else. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't subscribe unless you want upload schedules with the Technoblades. Rest in peace.